Wow, I think I'm sunburned. That's a first. Anyway, it's another Twins Day. I'm Angela, and today we are talking about the perks of being boring. Or like, introverted. Or sober. Straight-edged. Things like that. No drinking. No smoking, no drugs, anything that makes you a goody two-shoes, that is me and Mainland. <laughs> we are good twins. <laughs> At parties and things, people are just like, why don't you drink? It's fun. You'll feel happier. And speaking from experience, I've seen the good and bad alcohol can do to a person. Not really on my bucket list. I mean, maybe one day I'll try it, but it's like, no thanks. So perks, going off of the party idea is that if I don't drink, I remember everything. I don't have to worry about like blacking out or forgetting what happened last night. And I have plenty of friends who have been in that situation the morning after and it does not look like it's fun. I get to laugh at my friends <laughs> who are drunk. Perks of not smoking, I don't have to worry. <laughs> about my lungs or my throat or voice going bad. Um, okay, I guess it's a bad <laughs> example. I don't have to like go outside to smoke because I need to. I don't have to worry about spending money on cigarettes or, or booze or any of that. Drugs are expensive. Like, that's a lot of money. I feel like there are other ways you could relax and loosen up, have real conversations with people, maybe. Perks of being introverted. Let's talk about that. That's like kind of on the same path because you don't deal with people. People, oh my God, they need to, people just need to stop. I personally can't handle crowds very well. Like, they scare me, they're so intimidating. Just a lot of people. I feel like I'm a people person, but I'm also not. Like, small groups, like two to three people, I'm good. But then, like, add a few more people and I'm like, ugh. Like, I just get super insecure and it's not fun. But, like, anyway, perks. We're talking about perks, not ranting. When you know a person who is introverted like you understand like when they say i've had too much people interaction today you're just like i get you and that's great when people understand what you mean another thing is hanging out with those people especially if they're not ah oh crap what's the word they're not draining you can just be with them for a long time and not feel like you need to go take a nap or something people underestimate the beauty of silence. I feel like there's always like subconscious pressure to constantly talk. People forget that you can enjoy another person's company without speaking. Concept. The world is so loud. Quiet is a treasure. Is that a quote? Oh my gosh. That was kind of nice. You're doing things that won't potentially kill you by the next day. I feel like the main perk to being boring is just like meeting other people who are also boring because you guys are all bound to be dorks. I mean, that's how I met you, Maitland, and other people and like most of my close friends were all just really weird. It's so comforting finding your own people. Boring people can have fun all by themselves without help from a substance. Boring life is where it's at. Stay boring, my friends. Well, this is such a great angle. Uh, um, <laughs> that was a weird face. Blah, blah. That's my wall. Please cut some of it out.